welcome to today. Today's video, we are starting a fresh from the car in our PJ. We uh, slept at the trailer for the first and last time of the whole entire summer. And now we are headed home to feed our horses for first coffee. Coffee always has to come first. The best thing about busy weekends is leftovers. I have to go down and pack my stuff because we are trailering in today. And I think I'm, I'm almost done with Polly. Like, I'm ready to learn to ride my mare. And like I told you guys yesterday, if you saw the video, I'm going to be showing soon. I'm going to show Stella. And it's just going to be a learning show. Learning for us both. Ah! Macy just about jumped into my salad. Macy. She's like, oh, I'm going to eat that salad. She's licking her lips. Anyway, every single time I'm about ready to ride, I'm like excited and I'm like, oh, today's the day I'm going to look awesome. Today my arms are going to be normal, my everything's going to be so good, and even if it's not true, I'm going to believe it because the more I believe it, the more likely it could happen. So go out there and believe in yourself today because nobody else ever is going to believe in you the way that you are going to believe in you, and you are the one that's going to make your dreams come true, not anybody else. Would you guys believe that... I learned the most stuff about horses when the girls were at camp. Yeah, that happened. I am so much more confident with Stella than I was before because I got to do so much on my own. When the girls are with me, they always take over and do it for me because I'm a little bit slower and I'm a little bit less sure, so they do it for me and I, I must do that with them. And so when they weren't here and I was under pressure because I had lessons to do, I was like, do it or die, sister. I should make a shirt that says that. I've also been taking advantage of them being gone and choosing the, my own saddle pad, the color that I want to wear each day. But I really like the light pink one that Fiona gave me. It's mine. She gave it to me. It means a lot. So I'm going to wear that one today. Light pink. Right, I'm freaking out a little tiny bit. Ah! Oh, God. There's a fly on me. So, that that's on my shoe, you guys. Like... <laughs> Ah! Do you think it's alive or do you think it's just hair? I gotta get help. Sophie! I want Sophie! There's a bug! Like, what the heck? Why? Why are you on my shoe? Is it a bug? Or is it hair? I'm freaking out. How did this- ah! Louise, is it a bug? You guys, is it a bug? <gasps> the horses are all watching me. They're like, what's going on? Should we get ready to run? Is it a bug? <laughs> well, it's on my shoe and I don't know what to do. Is it a bug or just hair? I tried to grab it off and then I freaked out because it I felt like it moved. Take it off, Sophie. Powerful bug girl. Is it hair? Is it just hair? I think it might be a caterpillar. Okay, we'll take that caterpillar off my... It might be poisonous, I don't know. I don't think it's poisonous. Take it off. Well, actually, I touched it, and it pushed the end in, and now the end is out again. So, it's possible it's alive. Listen, there's... Sophie, you need to get this off my shoe. <laughs> Come on. You're the famous bug girl. All right, go. Well, let's find a stick. Oh, good job. Is it just hair? I think there's legs on there. You think there's legs on there? Yeah. Oh my god, what the heck is this? <laughs> Are you alive? I think so, because I think it's curling up in a ball. This is not a caterpillar. This is a hair. Is it a hair? I don't know. But look it, it's got brown stuff all over my shoe now. Okay, bye. I don't want to forget anything and I forget what I need. I got the saddle. I don't even know if this is my saddle, you guys. I got the girth and my helmet and my boots. One of the problems is I don't have my own stuff. I don't have like, I didn't go out there and buy all the things I need for myself. So I don't know what is what. So I need to do that. So I'm gonna actually have a horse. Like, I actually, I feel like there's a buck in my boot. Something in my boot. You can't stand bugs. And you know how after you see a bug, 
you feel like everything man I need to buy myself new boots Sam I want to go buy new boots there was a bug on my boot like in a, your boot like a cocoon growing on my boot <laughs> it's not funny they are doing Schleich again. Schleich is back. You don't just go and walk over, you have to climb underneath the bar. Well, the nobody told me that. So, the reason, guys, the reason why the front bars are closed is because last time Stella tried to trample me. So, I and, know. And, and I walked her in, I was tying her up, and she just sat, decided to bolt out and almost kill me. So, basically, I had to go under, and I am not like super good at going under, so I banged the bar, and then Stella backed up, and then I was like. Should I hold on or should I let go? And then after I got the first little uh, burn, I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna no, let go. I let go and you let go. No, I got the burn first. Everybody needs one burn to learn how to trailer. Okay, so basically I tried loading for the very first time ever and I made a mistake. I didn't realize I had to go underneath the bar, the front bar. Usually we just like walk on, but the girls learned last time that so Stella likes the to- the front bar, they can't run in yeah, on so, off of you. Yeah, so I, last second I tried to go under and I banged my back and it made a big noise and Stella blew off the thing and I got my first rope burn. Literally, it only you was like I one know? second and then I let go of the rope because I know you're supposed to let go of the rope. But listen, I just want to tell you guys that I'm going to leave that clip in there of the mistake that I made. I'm going to get 37 emails, 515 Instagram messages, and a whole lot of comments telling me what I did wrong and how I could do it better. I already know what I did wrong. I already learned what I could do better. But I'm going to share it anyway because it is such an incredibly valuable lesson because we learn um, not because you guys are all gonna learn what not to do because of what I did but I want you all to know that making mistakes is okay I want you guys all to know that getting 500 Instagram messages and 300 email messages and whatever I said for comments um, is okay it doesn't mean any it just means that people want to talk about it with you and share with you and that is okay so I just want you guys to go out there be real make mistakes make your own mistakes and it doesn't matter if all the people that went before you that made those mistakes want to tell you how not to do it you still need to make your own mistakes because it's the real way that you grow and learn because let me tell you I will never load sail that way again because I have a blister Oh, 
thousand feet Raindrops falling on the street I can't recall when I last saw the sun Summer's just a memory A faded piece of history No one can remember all the fun The late night barbecue Zipping on a genie juice Cruising I never shy away from a good time Coming on Friday night I see my friends and feel alright There ain't no stopping us from having fun There ain't no cloud in sight The future is looking right like about this barn is that they have this little courtyard here and our horses are able to just kind of walk around and do whatever they want while the while the rest of the lessons are going on so they're cleaning up some weeds because they haven't seen weeds in a long time Okay, so in the office at the place that we ride, there are some, some jackets. There's this one and then some smaller ones. So I'm going to try this one on. Oh, uh, it's too small, I think. Nope. Close though. But I lost 20 more pounds. We have one at home that actually does fit me, but it's a little bit tight in the back, like uh, like across my hips. So I'll probably just buy one. Okay, you are such a precious girl. I never shy away from a good time Coming on Friday night I see my friends and feel alright There ain't no stopping us from having fun There ain't no cloud in sight The future is looking right and today was just horrible it was absolutely horrible everything was phenomenal and amazing until we got to the barn 
And I realized I forgot a piece that I needed for Stella's saddle. I told you, I. Mom, yeah. the other one had this yeah. in the front I know. and this in the back. So anyway, um, then I ended up having to ride in Storm Saddle and Gabby was upset. She was worried that I was gonna stretch out her her leathers, which just happened before, and then everything went downhill from there. That first mm -hmm. act of frustration set us all <laughs> up for disaster. No, I had a good lesson. Gabby did have a good lesson. What happened in your lesson, Gabby, that you learned? I get to use spurs soon. She's almost winning the, op the she's almost getting the opportunity and the, and the no, right. No, I'm almost ready for spurs. Yeah, that's what she was trying to say. She's that's almost ready for spurs because she is learning to keep her leg really still. Um, and one major thing, if you guys seen, I mean, in the in last yeah. lessons you might have seen. Miniatures Listen. stuffed with pieces. And, uh, Previous lessons, you might have seen Brandon getting upset that she's jumping over Storm's neck, and we never really understood. And then Fiona found the magic button today, and she said to stay exactly the same, don't change your position. Just no, I two point a little. Yeah. So anyway, she managed to figure out how to jump without going over Storm's neck, and it really made a big difference. So that was a huge, amazing bonus for her. And Sophie, what did you learn? What was today's? Keeping so, my horse lighter. So, Sophie doesn't like to canter Finn anymore because he, on occasion, will start to buck because he learned that he can. I want so my get stirrup. Up. So the last two times he's done it, she's pulled him up and said, don't you do it. And he's, he's been like, oh crap. I lost my stirrup today. I thought I was going to fall off. I don't like, I'm not falling off today. Yeah, but I mean... So all in all, our lessons turned out okay in the end, but there was this big, huge chunk in the middle where we were all under pressure and all stressed out and it wasn't good. And the reason why it wasn't good is because we were bringing all this stress to other people. Like all the people surrounding us were faced with this stress too. And I, it makes me feel bad when we do that to people. And so we're gonna be working on that. We yeah. uh, no, we are all gonna you be working are. on that. It's no. too bright. You're gonna like not see us. Like I'm just yeah. gonna like Oh, so the other things that went wrong today was that um, my camera equipment was all messed up. I couldn't get it to, I couldn't figure it out. Um, Stella was a bit stiff. She wasn't in our last like ride. She was fine in our last ride. She's a bit stiff today, so we're going to try another ride with her and see how she is. If she is a bit stiff still, then we're going to get her hawk injected. Um, so yeah, like just everything was just going crazy. What color of bra are you wearing? Purple. It's pink? Yeah, plaid. It broke. It broke. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.